Well, my name is Matthew Gaines, and I'm with um, an engineering um, firm called McCormick Stevenson. We're here today to um, talk about um, a process that we've been working on to develop um, missile and bomb housings. Um, um, it's called flow forming. Um, there are associated technologies like um, um, hot spinning and um, also something just called spin forming. But these technologies combined can be used to replace the incumbent um, processes that are used to manufacture bombs today, which is forging. It's been around for, you know, at least for making manufacturing bombs since the 40s. We don't use this technology today but some of our allies and possibly our adversaries may use this technology. Um, if, you know, we never use this type of technology for making munitions because we didn't need to. We already had an existing industrial base that produced um, weapons the way they always have been produced and there was never a need to, you know, go beyond that. But, you know, when you have processes that have the potential of yielding, you know, tighter tolerances and better performance, um, there's resistance due to the fact that the current processes are already capitalized, they're already installed, and there's not a, a great deal of incentive to move to something new. And we're, we're hoping we can offer you know, the Navy an opportunity to do something new and possibly better. This process can ensure tighter tolerances um, and it potentially can, you know, those tighter tolerances can result in better um, accuracy in, the, in placing the weapon, you know, in a combat situation. So if you make them all the same, they tend to fly all the same and they all tend to go to the same location when you target. So this process, again, improves tolerances um, and makes the, you know, each bomb more similar to each other. So, um, and we have um, been reasonably successful in using the process. Um, it's not a revolutionary type process. It's been done before. So, um, it's it's new it's not new but it's new to us and one of the reasons why we haven't been doing it is because we have an old and you know investment in technologies that you know doing it the old way but basically um, we would like to propose this as a as a way of uh, manufacturing um, as you see in this picture here um, this is the resultant um, um, housing that you get off the machine when it, the process is just completed. You have this glowing hot um, um, housing that this is the O-drive here, this section that you would have right here. Um, so you form both ends of this using a process called hot spinning. And, you know, you get a object that looks very much like a Bomb. What has been beneficial being here at the showcase today? You know, the only interactions I've had with Nav Air has been with my um, my TPOC. And, you know, you, you hear, you know, the interest that he has in the technology. But, you know, when you get an opportunity to speak with other people in the community, you know, other people from Nav Air, you can get a sense of, oh, wow, you know, there's a, there's a real need. They're like, we've been looking at this technology and we've been watching your program to find out, you know, to see how you're going and, and you know, we're, we're really interested in seeing this, you know, field it. So um, having that sense of, you know, one person telling you that something's important is one thing, but when you have other people who know about your project and they're telling you the same thing, um, it helps reinforce a sense of urgency and importance of what the work that you're actually doing. So that is, you know, one of the benefits that I got from coming here. Awesome. And, you know, we, we did get to meet a couple people who were, you know, 
um, from, from other primes that were interested in having further discussions or, or passing the information along. Um, actually, before we came here, we got a call from a major prime and they are tr interested in setting up a meeting to discuss the technology as well. So the program has been very beneficial. They said it was near record for getting a, you know, uh, a, a um, potential um, prime customer interested in the technology. So it's been, it's been very beneficial. So.